Okay, so the project that I was gonna upload is taking a little longer than expected because I got sidetracked by a couple of other things. So I thought I'd just make a really quick video about something interesting. And the something interesting, why is Ichigo's hair orange? Now, originally, Ichigo had black hair in the one-shot manga of Bleach, but when Kudo got contracted to release Bleach on Weekly Shonen Jump, he changed Ichigo's hair color to orange for some reason. And canonically, Ichigo does not bleach his hair. So why is it orange if both of his parents, his mom and his dad, had black or brown hair and from our traditionally Japanese descent? What's interesting about this is that I actually thought it was bleached for the longest time because that's just his type of character. Yeah, of course, because it's such a common occurrence for the punk-esque character in an anime or in any Japanese art form to bleach his hair because they want to stand out compared to all the other Japanese men that have black hair. But for Ichigo to go out of his way to explain that he does not bleach his hair, he it's naturally orange, it's kind of a shock in like in regards to like genetics and everything, everything we know about the character. And yes, while they are like technical spoilers or the canonical reason why it's orange or whatever, like later in the story, that's not really why it's orange. That's why, that's how the author explains canonically why it's orange, but there's something a little more symbolic about it. Ichigo, if at first glance, he's a punk. He's a punk with a golden heart, or a punk with a heart of gold, and there's just there's just so much to him that you're not going to see at first glance, and you have to really get to know the character to see what he's all about. So most people in society would look at Ichigo and already make an assumption on who he is as a person. Hell, that's what happened to me. In my head, Ichigo was a punk, a rebel, so therefore it made sense that he would also bleach his hair to stand out. But that's just simply not the case. Ichigo isn't a poser. He's not trying to stand out. He's not doing anything intentional to be shunned by society. Society is the problem. Society is the one that looks at him, makes a conclusion, and then treats him accordingly. They look at his temper, his bleached hair, his attitude, his resting bitch face, and they think, this guy is a degenerate. And it all boils down to the orange hair. The simple fact that it's orange, naturally, is a metaphor for how so many people can draw a conclusion on him as a person based on his orange hair, assuming it's bleached, but in reality, it's natural. And that's how, why people misinterpret him. What better way to exemplify a misunderstood character in the face of all the punk-esque tendencies he has, than for his bleached colored hair to be, in fact, natural. <laughs> yeah, ah, shit. <laughs> People don't really give a shit that I'm recording anything. But yeah, if you like this video, please subscribe. Um, I'm writing a book right now, and it's being uploaded on Honeyfeed. And the link is in the description below. And to be fair, it's kind of like Bleach, kind of like Yu Yu Hakusho, kind of like a lot of things, honestly. This is me just like making a story out of all the things I love about anime. And uh, I don't know, it's getting a lot of traction. And so far, the few people I've shown it to really seem to like it. So maybe check it out if you want to. If you by happen to be seeing this and you're not already subscribed, subscribe to my channel. Have a good day. And I'll see you next time.